5-HT or serotonin agonist, antagonist and treatment of migraine. Welcome to Pharmacomania. I am Shahnaz Malik and we are going to discuss serotonin agonist, antagonist and treatment of migraine. 5-HT or serotonin was named given to the vasoconstrictor substance which appear in the serum when blood clotted and uh, it is 90% of the body is contained 5-HT localized in the intestine most of the rest is in the platelet and in the brain it is also found in flying insect scorpion sting and widely distributed in intervertebrate and plant like banana pear pineapple tomato stinging nettle and cowage Serotonin act as neurotransmitter or local hormone, component of the platelet clotting factor and role in the migraine. Mediator of signs symptom of carcinoid syndrome and serotonin antagonist are used as a treatment or therapy. Now synthesis and destruction of the serotonin. Like norepinephrine, serotonin is also synthesized within the nerve terminal and released upon the depolarization. So from tryptophan, it enter, tryptophan enter into the nerve terminal and uh, it uh, convert into 5 hydroxy tryptophan in presence of tryptophan hydroxylase. This enzyme tryptophan hydroxylase is a rate limiting enzyme. If it is absent, then it is not possible to formation of serotonin. Now, 5-hydroxytryptamine is decarboxylase uh, through decarboxylase enzyme. Decarboxylation occur and it form the 5-HT. 5-HT now enter into the vesicle by vesicular monoamine transporter. This is the vesicular monoamine transporter and 5 uh, serotonin enter into the vesicle. Otherwise, it will degrade by the Mao enzyme. So, now uh, serotonin stored into the vesicle and whenever action potential generate, calcium will enter into the neuron and this calcium, due to calcium, this vesicle move toward the membrane and through exocytosis, uh, 5-HT will release into the synaptic cleft. After releasing 5-HT into the synaptic cleft, either it will bind post-synaptic receptor or pre-synaptic autoreceptor or it will reuptake by the neuron. This is the first reuptake. This is by the serotonin transporter and it is inhibited by the tricyclic antidepressant or SSRI or selective uh, serotonin reuptake inhibitor. This is the serotonin uh, transporter is inhibited by SSRI or tricyclic antidepressant. Second uptake is uh, a vesicular monoamine transporter and this is the inhibited by reservoir. If this uptake is doesn't occur then uh, this uh, 5-HT will degrade by monoamine oxidase. So serotonin is also taken up into the presynaptic terminal using serotonin transporter and SSRI reuptake inhibitor causes increase the concentration of uh, 5-HT in the synaptic cleft and utilized for the treatment of depression. High concentration of 5-HT is found into intestine, platelet and brain. So approximately 90% of the 5-HT is found into intestine and it is involved in the condition like migraine, affective disorder, psychosis, GI disorder and sleep disorder. There are seven types of the seven type of the serotonin receptor 5-HT1, 5-HT2, 5-HT3, 5-HT4, 5, 6 and 7. Now 5-HT1 is subdivided into 5-HT1A, 1B and 1D. 1C is reclassified into 5-HT2 group. So 5-HT2 group having 5-HT2A, 2B and 2C uh, receptor. Now all are uh, G protein coupled receptor except 5-HT3. 5-HT3 is the ligand gated channel, ion channel. This is the ligand gated ion channel. Now, drugs that modify the action of serotonin at the presynaptic uh, neuron. So, presynaptic agents are degradation inhibitor like it is inhibit the degradation of serotonin are mao inhibitors monoamine oxidase are used as a antidepressant or it can be used as antihypertensive drug another drug is the storage inhibitor like amphetamine 
methylphenidate and modafinil these are the uh, drugs which inhibit the storage and increase the release third is the reuptake inhibitor like selective noradrenaline reuptake inhibitor serotonin selective reuptake inhibitor and tricyclic antidepressants so these all drug inhibit the reuptake at the new nerve ending and increase the concentration of the serotonin at the synaptic cleft and increase the effect in the depressant and affective disorder the figure above depict that serotonin neurotransmitter may be modified at the presynaptic level by inhibiting degradation storage and reuptake so here are various mechanism first one is the serotonin uh, transporter which is inhibited by serotonin reuptake inhibitor or tricyclic uh, antidepressant which causes 5-HT remain at the site of the synaptic cleft 5-HT remain at the site of synaptic cleft and causes increase the concentration of 5-HT at the site of uh, action and uh, the second one is the uh, monoamine oxidase enzyme which is inhibited by monoamine oxidase inhibitor so it inhibit uh, the uh, destruction of 5-HT so increase the concentration of 5-HT and uh, also it effective in uh, this uh, drug effective in the depression as well as affective and uh, psychiatric disorder now 5-HT1 receptor are subdivided into 5-HT1 A, B, D, E and F 5-HT1C C C is uh, reclassified into 5-HT2C and now all subtype of the 5-HT1 receptor are inhibited by adenylyl cyclase and all are G-protein coupled receptor. The most important location of 5-HT1A are at the rafe nucleus of the brainstem and hippocampus. So, serotonergic receptor uh, are bind with the serotonin. Uh, it is the endogenous neurotransmitter. Now, 5-HT1A agonist drugs are buspirone is partially 5-HT1A agonist and used for clinically for the treatment of anxiety and depression. Buspirone is used for anxiety and depression and it is agonist of the 5-HT1A receptors. Now, 5-HT1B and 5-HT1D uh, like triptan are drug uh, useful abortive medication for the treatment of acute migraine. So, triptans are 5-HT1AB and 5-HT1AD agonist. So, uh, they are very effective medication for the bind uh, to 5-HT1B and D receptor in cranial vessel which lead to vasoconstriction and decrease the release of neuropeptides involved in sterile inflammation. Now, 5-HT2 receptor, there are three subtypes of the 5-HT2 receptors. 5-HT2A uh, receptor also inhibit potassium channel, resulting in slow depolarization occur. 5-HT2C agonist are uh, trazodone. was previously believed that 5-HT2C receptor antagonist. However, recent publication report shows that trazodone would be have 5-HT2C agonist. So, this is the trazodine is the 5-HT2C agonist. This drug is used generally for somnorific. It is the related to sleep disturbance. Now, 5-HT3 receptor is the ligand gated receptor and it is which the nicotinic acetylcholine receptor is the prototype. So, 5-HT3 receptor, receptors are neuronal receptor and uh, it rapidly depolarizes the nerve ending and opening of the cation channel located within it. So, uh, causes auto, uh, somatic and autonomic nerve ending, causes pain, each coronary chemoreflex and fall in blood pressure due to withdrawal of sympathetic tone. So, it is present in the nerve ending of myotic plexus and augmentation of peristalsis and emetic reflux and also present in the area of uh, postema and nucleus tractus solitar in the brain stem so nausea and vomiting occur if this area is stimulated so now these uh, receptors are blocked by the 5-HT it is the ondansetron and pelanocetron which inhibit the 5-HT3 receptor and it antagonize the uh, emetic or uh, vomiting reflux so it is used for the uh, nausea vomiting particularly 
treatment with the chemotherapy induced nausea and vomiting now here is the action of the serotonin whenever uh, chemotherapy or radiotherapy induced damage of the cell in the intestine damage of the cell into the intestine causes release of serotonin these uh, uh, this serotonin uh, passes the transmit the signal vomiting signal to the brain through uh, now from the intestinal to the brain and it stimulate the vomiting center and vomiting occur so whenever releases the serotonin we can introduce 5-HT antagonists which block that 5-HT3 receptor which is uh, increasing uh, vomiting sensation so it inhibited by the 5-HT3 blocker like condensatron and granisetron which inhibit the vomiting sensation. Now 5-HT4 agonist uh, cisapride is the seroton uh, serotonin as well as cholinergic agonist use as prokaryotic drug it is withdrawn from the u.s market because of the cardiotoxicity and uh, 5st4 receptor has been demonstrated in the mucosa plexus uh, and smooth muscle of the gut probably involved in augmentation of the intestinal secretion and peristalsis and uh, it is also located in brain now subtype of the 5st receptor so first one is the 5st1 receptor its location is CNS and uh, cranial blood vessel and uh, actions are first of all is the it is autoreceptor and decrease 5-HT release from the now ending <coughs> and uh, drug is the buspirone it is 5-HT1 partial agonist and it is used uh, as anti-anxiety agent second uh, action is the constriction of the cranial vessel so it is used in the migraine Triptan is the selective 5-HT1 and um, 1B and 1D agonist. So it is used in the migraine, <coughs> acute attack of migraine. Third one is the decrease um, release of peptide at the now ending. So drug is the arcotamine. It is antagonist and partial agonist at all the subtype of 5-HT receptors. Now 5-HT2 receptors, location are on platelet, smooth muscle, cerebral cortex, fundus of stomach and choroid plexus. So first of all, the action on the platelet is the platelet aggregation and drug is the ketanserin which is 5-HT2A antagonist which inhibit the platelet aggregation. Ketanserin is potent antihypertensive drug. It also uh, act on the alpha-1 receptor. So, uh, it can be used as an antihypertensive drug. So, on smooth muscle, contraction of the smooth muscle, so drug is a prohibited and it is a selective 5-HT2A antagonist, so it inhibits the contraction of the muscle. Now, on the cerebral cortex, activation of the neuron, methyl serrid, it is the 5-HT2A uh, and 2C antagonist. On fundus of the stomach, contraction of the uh, stomach, so atypical antipsychotic like 5-HT2A antagonist and uh, last one is the choroid plexus so it is uh, action is the CSF production now 5-HT receptor are present at the nu nucleus tectus solitaire and chemoreceptor triggering zone and uh, action is the uh, vomiting and increase the peristalsis on dancetron and granisetron which inhibit the 5-HT3 receptor and block the vomiting and decrease the peristalsis. 5-HT4 receptor are present at the GIT and CNS and increase peristalsis. Drug is metoclopramide. It's, it is selective 5-HT2A agonist. 5-HT5-7 receptor are present in CNS. Now action of the serotonin. Whenever platelet contact with injured endothelium, they release substance that promote the platelet aggregation. And secondarily, they release the 5-HT uh, or serotonin. 5-HT bind to the platelet, 5-HT2A receptor and elicit weak aggregation of the uh, aggregation response and that is markedly augmented by the collagen. If the damaged blood vessel is injured, deep to the vascular smooth muscle and expose um, muscle, vascular smooth muscle is exposed 5-HT excel directly vasoconstriction effect therefore contribution of hemostasis which enhanced by the locally released autocoid like thomboxan, kinin and vasoactive peptides so, so here is the mechanism of uh, action of the 
serotonin on the platelet so vascular uh, vascular injury occur so in, uh, initial platelet aggregation occur so uh, aggregation of platelet causes release of phist after releasing of phist it act on the phist one like receptor and endothelial release substance like nit Trick oxide and vasodilatation occur. Uh, another way, phist 2A receptor uh, bind with the serotonin and accelerated platelet aggregation and thrombus formation and ultimately hemostasis and vascular occlusion. Uh, here, phist 2A receptor also occ occupied by the serotonin and vasoconstriction occur and ultimately it result is the hemostasis and vascular occlusion. Action of serotonin on vascular uh, cardiovascular system. So first of all, phist is the vasoconstrictor, particularly larger vessel like splenic, uh, renal, pulmonary, and cerebral vasculature. And it is also positive anotropic and chronotropic on heart. And uh, activation of phist receptor can cause uh, vagus nerve ending stimulus, elicit the basalgeric reflex, which causes extreme bradycardia and hypotension. Effect on blood pressure. Uh, triphasic response can be seen with intravenous injection. For a uh, first uh, early sharp fall is seen due to the coronary chemoreflex. Brief rise due to vasoconstriction and increased cardiac output. And prolonged fall uh, seen due to the arterial and vasodilatation and extravasation of the fluid. Uh, effect of serotonin on the visceral smooth muscle are like uh, it is potent uh, stimulator of GIT both direct as well as through the anteric plexus and uh, several subtype like phist receptor are present in the gut so increased peristalsis and diarrhea can occur and phist constrict bronchi but it is less potent than the histamine action on other smooth muscle in the men are feeble and consistent on the gland, phist inhibit gastric secretion, both acid as well as pepsin, but increase mucus production. Uh, it does the uh, has uh, also a protective property and effect on other glandular secretion is not significant. Effect on nerve ending, activation of apparent nerve ending, tingling and pricking sensation can occur and pain force uh, can occur. Effect on respiration, brief stimulation of respiration and hyperventilation can occur. Large doses can cause transient apnea. Effect on CNS, uh, direct injection in the brain causes sleepiness, change in body temperature, hunger and behavioral effects. Now, pathophysiological role of the serotonin uh, as a neurotransmitter of the brain, it involves in sleep, temperature regulation, thought, cognitive function, behavioral and mood. If imbalance can cause affective disorder, schizophrenia, vomiting and pain perception. Precursor of melatonin in the pineal gland. So it regulates biological clock and maintains circadian rhythm. Now neuroendocrinal function is the hypothalamic neuron that control release of anterior pituitary hormone are probably regulated by serotonergic mechanism in nausea and vomiting specially work by cytotoxic drug or radiotherapy mediated release of phist in the intestine causes uh, increase receptor phist receptor in the gut and area prostoma and nucleus uh, tectus solitaire causes stimulation of phist receptor and uh, um, nausea and vomiting sensation can occur in migraine migraine in initial stage uh, was a constriction phase of the migraine but participated in the neurogenic inflammation of the cranial blood vessel hemostasis it causes platelet aggregation clot formation at the site of injury to blood vessel and also promote reduction of injury vessel injured vessel and uh, in Reynolds phenomena of IST release from platelet may trigger acute vasospastic episode of the larger vessel in hypertension Increase responsiveness of IHT and decrease uptake and clearance by platelets seen in hypertensives. Ketanserin is useful as an antihypertensive property. Intestinal motility 
enterochromaffin-cell and 5-HT containing neuron regulate the peristalsis and local reflexes in the gut. Now, carcinoid tumor, it is produced massive amount of 5-HT, bowel hypermotility can occur and bronchoconstriction in carcinoid due to 5-HT. Pellegram may occur due to diversion of diprofen for the synthesizing 5-HT. Now, individual drug affecting on the 5-HT receptor. First is the azapirones like buspirone, gepirone and epsapirone. Other rare novel class of anti-anxiety drug which do not cause sedation and act on the 5-HT1A receptor as agonist. Sumatriptan is another triptan that affect 5-HT1D and 1B agonist and constrict cerebral blood vessel and have emerged as the most effective treatment on the acute migraine attack. Cisapride is the prokinetic drug and increase gastrointestinal motility as a selective 5-HT for agonist. Rhizopride is still more selective for 5-HT forces. Superheptidine, it uh, blocks the 5-HT2A receptor and its section is like a uh, antihistaminic, anticholinergic and sedative property. It increases appetite in children and poor eater to promote weight gain and it uh, used to control intestinal manifestation of the carcinoid and uh, a post gastrectomy dumping syndrome. It also antagonizes the priapism and orgasmic delay due to fluoxetine and desertone. It also used in allergic condition and side effects are like uh, tausiness, dryness of mouth, confusion, ataxia and weight gain. These are the adverse drug reaction of the ciproheptidine. Now methyl circuit is the action on 5-HT receptor on smooth muscle include that uh, of the blood vessel it uh, potent uh, 5g 2a and 2c receptor blocker used in migraine prophylaxis carcinoid and post gastrectomy dumping syndrome side effects are abdominal pulmonary and endocardial fibrosis on the prolonged use ketanserin is 5g 2 antagonist and uh, it induce it uh, block 5-HT2 induce vasoconstriction, platelet aggregation, and contraction of airway smooth muscle. It also act on alpha-1, H1, and dopaminergic blocking activity, and it is useful in anti as an antihypertensive by uh, blocking alpha-1 receptor. And ritanserin is more selective 5-HT2A congener than the ketanserin. Clozapine, it is a typical antipsychotic drug which block the dopamine as well as 5-HT2A and 2C receptor. It also uh, an uh, inverse agonist at the cerebral 5-HT2A and 2C receptor, so used in resistance schizophrenic patient. Resperidone is the atypical antipsychotic act on the 5-HT2A and dopamine 2 receptor and agonist like clozapine and used in schizophrenia. Ondansetron is the 5-HT3 antagonist used to control nausea and vomiting in anti-cancer and radiotherapy patient. And granisetron and tropisetron are another selective 5-HT. Now clinical pharmacology of serotonin. Serotonin has no clinical application as a drug, but its agonist and antagonist has many clinical implications. Like serotonin is closely related with the behavior mood and their important many neuropsychiatric disorder so it, uh, it is used as a symptomato, uh, symptomatic treatment and also role in the many clinical conditions uses of serotonin antagonists are major uh, depression obsessive compulsive disorder phobic state um, premenstrual symptom somatoform disorder post-traumatic disorder, all this behavioral condition can be treated with the selective serotonin reuptake inhibitor like fluoxetine and sertalin. Other conditions like uh, anxiety neurosis can be treated with buspirone. 
and other condition like in migraine, sumatriptan can be used for appetite stimulant, ciproheptidine and schizophrenia, clozapine can be used, chemotherapy induced, nausea, vomiting, ondansetrin can be used for GRD, GERD and irritable bowel syndrome, mozapride can be used. Now serotonin syndrome. What is serotonin syndrome? If monoamine oxidase inhibitor plus selective serotonin uh, reuptake inhibitor are given simultaneously, then uh, excess uh, increase in serotonin level in the brain. So serotonin syndrome can occur. So symptoms are the like a delirium, agitation, tachycardia, diaphoresis, and diarrhea uh, can occur. Now sign a sign of uh, myoclonus and uh, hyperreflexia and rare symptoms are uh, hypothermia, seizure, rhabdomyosis and renal failure, cardiac arrhythmia and disseminated intravascular coagulation can occur. Now how to treat this patient? First of all, give the symptomatic relief to the patient like uh, uh, stop all the treatment or oh, stop the treatment and treat the symptomatically and give serotonin antagonists like ciproheptadine. Thank you for watching the video.